Hey guys, it's Brian the Shaving Geek here with another episode of My Shave of the Day. Today I used another new product, uh, which I'm very excited to talk about, so let's get right to it. Uh, today I used my Escali Badger brush, real low-end brush. Uh, this is actually what I started out with, and it doesn't get much use anymore. But the, the uh, soaps that I've been uh, playing around with this week from the uh, Dr. John's uh, Shave Market Pass Round are all very soft soaps. And so I thought, you know what, it's time to get the Escali out or Escali out and take it for a run just because I haven't in a while. Um, to be honest with you, it was a little scritchy today and I don't really remember this badger being all that scritchy, but it was. Uh, but uh, you know, other than that, it performed well and uh, so no complaints. But I definitely like my boars a lot better. Uh, today I used my uh, Fat Boy, Executive Fat Boy, again on a 4. Uh, I don't change much from that. And uh, this is just, uh, the reason I've been using this razor over and over and over again this week is because I am um, working on that pole silver blade and uh, just testing it out, wanting to kind of get my impressions on it. So this is the third shave on this blade. And uh, up to this point, you know, I had somebody respond the other day uh, to one of my videos how much they love the Pole Silver and it's their go-to blade. And, uh, you know, quite frankly, I like it. I, I can't say that I love it. And the premium in price to me, for me, isn't warranted. Now, if you love it and it's your go-to blade, great for you. But uh, for me... Uh, personally, I definitely am just as happy with the Gillette Silver Blues, which, a little bit, which are a little bit cheaper, uh, and uh, looking forward to trying the repairs, which would be a lot cheaper. Today, uh, for the new product, I used Hydra from uh, Dr. John's uh, Soap Works, and this is their citrus, and it has every citrus, I think, just about known to man in it. Uh, grapefruit, orange, lemon, mandarin, lime, and bergamot. And let me tell you something, this is a very, very nice, if you like citrus, you are going to love Hydro. Uh, if I had any one complaint, while the scent is great and I really like it, and it's definitely a very realistic, it's not a fake citrus, it's definitely a real citrus smell, it is a bit weak to me when I compare it to... Um, my lime that I have from Eva Nesterova, which is a very strong soap, uh, smelling soap, or my uh, um, orange menthol from Maggard, or let's see, what other citrus do I have? I've got a number of citrus uh, scents, and compared to these other citrus scents that I have, this is a tad bit weak uh, compared to them. So for me, I would like to see the scent profile bump up just a little bit more, but I'm not a, um, you know, an expert when it comes to uh, fragrance oils and essential oils and all of that stuff as far as how they react. So they may have just go gone a little weaker on the scent um, because of that. I don't know. But for me, uh, I would like to see the scent profile boosted just a little bit. Having said that, I keep talking about the awesomeness of the labels, and this is no exception. Excellent labeling. I just love the labeling on this product. Performance was, was very good. I, I definitely learned from my mistake yesterday, made sure that I loaded a little bit longer uh, on this, and I had no problem whatsoever uh, getting a two-pass shave out of this. As I have shown before, this is definitely a softer soap. Not uh, quite as soft as Katie's Bubbles, uh, French style, but almost. Definitely a very, very soft soap. You can see I have no problem whatsoever uh, indenting that with my finger. So, that being said, very happy with this soap. I really like it. It's uh, definitely uh, this whole lineup uh, so far, all of the ones that I've tried is on my list to acquire. My one complaint with this, if you want to call it a complaint, suggestion, whatever you want to call it, is that I would like to have the scent profile boosted just a little bit. To uh, finish up today, I used Fine Platinum, and let me tell you something, this is just a phenomenal, phenomenal aftershave. Woo! Good stuff. In fact, it's great stuff. I really, really like this. I'm so glad I have it, and it was a, a great way to complete a, a great start to my morning. It's a chilly morning here in upstate New York. The uh, storm went about 50 miles uh, east of us, so we're just getting you know little dribs and drabs, nothing like what they had forecasted, which is kind of disappointing because tomorrow I'm going snowboarding with my brothers. But uh, 
you know, it is what it is, and uh, that's my, my son was very disappointed today. The, cl the school districts around us all closed, but ours kind of right in the middle. We always wait to the last minute because we're hardy folk, and they didn't, and uh, so he was very disappointed. Anyhow, I'm rambling. Let me get right back to it as far as a wrap-up. Uh, Escali Badger Brush, Executive Fat Boy on a number four, and uh, Pole Silver Blade. Uh, third shave on that blade. Hydra from Dr. John Soapworks. And then I finished up with the Platinum from Fine for a two pass. Uh, DFS shave, very great way to start the day. This is Brian the Shaving Geek reporting live from my shave then wishing you a lifetime of happy shaves. Have a great day everybody.